What's up, what's up, what's up? It's Mr. E coming at you from Mr. E. Pool lessons and quick tips in the pool. How you guys doing today? I hope all is well. Like I say, I hope all is well, guys. Okay, today we're going to work on something. Oh, first of all, one of my subscribers uh, live up the street, and he's on the APA. He say, hey, Mr. E, uh, uh, how do you practice when you get ready for a game? I say, how do you practice? He say, well, I go to the pool hall, put a rack up, break a rack, and I might play about 10 racks, and then I go into a tournament. I say, really? He said, yeah. He said, don't you practice like that for a tournament? I said, hell no. He said, what do you mean? I said, young fella, I practice on pre-shot routine, proper body alignment, perfect stroking pool, meditation, visualization, staying focused, cue ball control, Pat and play. Uh, defensive shots. I work out in the gym, strengthen my core. I do a lot of uh, looking at the pros play. I work on my stroke, just straighten my, my bridge hand out. And the last thing, this is a drill I'm getting ready to play now that nobody likes to work on. It's defense. So this is a, a drill that's totally uh, geared to defense behind the fact I just came off a five-day tournament about two weeks ago, and I beat two players that I haven't beat in a long time, the number one player and the number two player from my social club. And the reason why I beat them is my cue ball control was pretty good, and my defense was excellent. So I said, okay. When I go back to training facility, I'm going to work on more cue ball control and a lot of defense. Now, if you get a good a player that's a little better than you are, if you could stop him, if you could take his legs out from underneath of him, if you could take him out of his rhythm, if you could uh, make him start missing, he's going to get frustrated because he's not used to doing that. So you done got him two ways. You done got him in the mind, and he's not shooting right. If you can slow him down, it gives you better chances of winning the game. So here we go, working on defensive drills. Oh, by the way, guys, that's Mr. E right there when I was working. I was a burner. I cut shit apart. So that's what, that, that's what I did off and on. Well, I worked construction, and when they didn't have nothing new to go up, I, I would go burn. That's cutting something apart. Anyway, uh... That's what I'm doing now. We're cutting our games apart, and we're starting from the beginning, and that's the foundation. But I just wanted to show you guys where I got the idea from when I used to work. I used to, I used to have a job. I didn't just shoot pool all the time. Shit, I used to work down there. I worked for down there 30 years in construction union. Hard-ass work. Now I can just sit back and study pool and shoot pool, practice and go play. Isn't it great being in America? <laughs> Unfreaking believable. Okay, all right, let's get to this drill, guys. Okay, here we go, guys. I got a rack set up. I got about five or six cue balls. Now, what I'm going to do is look for defensive shots throughout the rack. It's just defensive shots. Places I can hide the cue ball, get the cue ball to the rail. If I can get the cue ball behind a couple of balls or stop the cue ball behind the ball, all defensive shots. Let's go. Saw Chang Yung Lin on the match table, the TV table, against Niels Fyan yesterday. And he started off so well, five breaking runs in a row, led 6 0. And did get back to 6 4, but made no further progress. And that one finished 11 4. It was one of the best performances we've seen on the main table so far. He's stumbling well again today. Yeah. 
that's an old saying in Vegas. I haven't seen it in some time, of course. Uh, Changed his technique a little bit. Uh, those holes didn't break anything like we've seen so far here. What is the final 16? I mean, now the SVB has a good chance of dry break, actually. Chang, who's played a lot, you know, has been a part of many of the rotation of the nine ball tournaments around the world. So he's been playing Chinese eight ball a bit more. And I noticed it immediately in Vegas when Washington played. Just a little different viewing. As you said, Jeremy, dry break. I mean, we've barely seen any of those on the main table all week. I'm actually struggling to think of another one can remember. Okay, guys, I'm trying to hide the cue ball or even get the cue ball to the rail. The average player, amateur player, do not practice shooting off the rail. And I, that's another thing that I practice as well because I'm going to be using defense, putting somebody on a the rail. They might put me back on the rail, and I'll be used to shooting off the rail. But the, the, the object of this is to get the cue ball behind a ball or even to the rail. Now, if you're playing somebody... And his balls at one table, and you have the opportunity to take a safe shot and send the cue ball to the opposite end of the, to the table and put it on a rail, stuff like that. So practice your defense, guys. I'm going to show you a couple more things. Okay, guys, that's basically how you work on your uh, defensive shots. I, I know nobody likes to do it, but it will really help you when you get in a game, especially when you're playing somebody that's a little better than you are. You really have uh, a game plan to go to to be able to stop them to give you a chance to win. So give it a try, guys. It really worked. I'm getting ready to play, and I'm working on it. I'll probably work on it for another hour. Then I'm going to go to cue ball control. So work on your defense. And you can also pull up more defensive drills off of you too and um that will help you with your defense that way before you know it you're playing a, one of them top players you're gonna you're gonna crack him and he's gonna be racking him he's gonna be down there like he don't know how to rack no balls because he don't normally do it because he always win but you, you you have to might have to show him how to rack the balls but that's how you'll do it to to be able to crack them and let them top players rack them until Mr. E upload again, peace. May God be with you. Work on your defense, guys. Shit really worked. Mr. E out.